Well, hello there, to Android TV. This is Mike Bates, bringing you another sneak peek at one of the new features from Android 4.2. This time, we have the new clock app. So let's get going. So, getting right into it here, we have my Galaxy Nexus, of course, and this is running 4.1.2. I just have a bunch of the leaked APKs and zips installed. So, here we go. We're just going to launch right in. We've got a new icon here for it. And first off, you're going to see that this is a radically re new design from the last generation from Ice Cream Sandwich and the original 4.1 Jelly Bean. So, starting off, we have this main screen here. It's got a clock, obviously. Down here in the lower right corner, or lower left corner, we have the alarm button. Here we have a location, and we have a menu, which pops up night mode, settings, and help. So, starting off, we're just going to go into the new alarm UI. You can see that I have a whole bunch of different alarms here. This looks very different from what we saw in previous versions of Android. It's got a nice UI. You can swipe the alarms off if you want to get rid of them. To turn them on, you simply just turn on, turn off, and if you hit this arrow right here, then it expands the details down. You can hit tell it to repeat, the description, the ringtone, which I have is Krypton, which is extremely obnoxious. <laughs> That's why I need to get up in the morning. And we also have the option to vibrate. So, this is the new alarm UI. It's very good. Just add alarms through that, or go into settings and help from here. We have style. Um, going through the settings, we have the style of clock, which is digital, automatic home clock, so it changes the time uh, to where we are on the, in the world. So I guess that changes, that changes through time zones. We have the home time zone. Silence after five minutes. So if it was ringing and you, you weren't there, it would silence after five minutes. Snooze length, five minutes. The alarm volume and the volume buttons serve as a snooze button. So let's go back. Back. So this is the main screen. You can see there's just a clock up here. It tells us the date. Nice font here. Pretty stylish. Swipe once to the right, we have the timer screen, where obviously we have hours, minutes, seconds. We can put in, so say I wanted to set this timer for 23 seconds, I could start that. And you have, you see you have this really nice UI where you can add one minute to it, you can delete and stop, you can delete the timer, you can put a name tag on it, or you can stop it. So this is really cool, and we're going to hear the alarm go off in a minute. I actually don't know what the alarm tone is, so this should be interesting. You can add another timer as well. Oh, I canceled out of it. So now... Two seconds, and there you go. So that is the timer function. Let's delete that. So that's the new timer UI. You can, of course, put in minutes, seconds, and hours into there. One swipe to the right, and we have the stopwatch feature. This is quite cool as well. Real, another really nice UI. You hit start. It starts going. You can see that it is a stopwatch. Basically, it tracks the time. Hit this once, and it means that it has a lap. Here you can see the laps down there. You can see it going around. Let's just lap it right there. Oop paused it by accident, so lap, you can see there's a little tick mark there from where I stopped it. Goes around, passes a tick mark, let's lap there. You can see it shows up there now. So, pretty cool UI. I really like the new functions of this clock, and a lot of other Android news sites have been really raving about this as well. I think it's pretty cool, and I think you guys probably will too. So this is another new feature in 4.2 Jelly Bean, which you guys will be seeing hitting hopefully pretty soon. Of course, the instructions to be installing this, it's a flashable zip this time, it will be down in the description, so feel free to check that out. Thanks so much guys for watching, please like this video if you enjoyed it. Feel free to go check out our other videos on our channel and subscribe there if you want to see more. Thanks guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys all next time. Peace.